Okay, Brad T presents number 11, Warwick Road in Stratford. Three bedroom ranch, probably built in 1964 in that range. The roof is dirty, looks like it could be clean. Gutters are dirty, yard's okay. Somewhat of a busy road, but uh, I think you can do a lot with the yard as far as getting uh, you know, traffic in and out, egress, ingress, all that good stuff. Let's uh, open it up. All right, so we're in the house, uh, three-bedroom ranch again. Windows were replaced probably in the 70s with metal replacement windows. Easy enough to pull out and put vinyl in. Pardon the, uh, the video. Kitchen, i got to tell you, the cabinets aren't bad. I think I'd clean them up with some spray nine, adjust, uh, adjust them a little bit, maybe throw some crown molding if you can match it up on the top. The... Um, Corner hutch, just leave paint. Again, replace the windows, get rid of the um, the room divider there, or that cheesy looking thing. I think I'd pull this up and out, probably take a, build a false wall, pull it up so it looks like it belongs. All right, what do we got back here? Oh, lovely, look at this. We got some termite damage, some serious, serious termite damage. Uh, you got to do a little investigating. The service looks like a 200 amp. What's it say? 150 amp. The heater is nice. It's a Goodman. Looks like it's got the original central air unit in there, but easy enough to fix. Water heater is kind of taking up some space, maybe a tankless unit. And then you can do a side-by-side -side washer dryer. Back door is skanky looking. I think it's just a paint job. This whole thing looks like they had uh, Waldo back here scratching away. But this, this kind of lends some, some uh, opportunity for some... Some things back here. Maybe put the dryer over here. Maybe close that in over there. Hey, this. All right. So you got a dining, dinette area, dining room area. You got a decent living room. I suspect there's hardwood floors under here. Five and a quarter inch base paint job. There's no wallpaper on the walls. That's nice. You got a kills lock tight. Do your stuff here. I think I think these windows will come out pretty easy. Pretty reasonable to put them in. You got some uh, casing concerns, very little. Bathroom, just consider a gut. It's three piece, not the end of the world. Uh, okay, so we have some really horrible looking parquet floors, just budget not to do them over, just laminate or carpets. Two windows in each bedroom. Some of the casings look like crap. Maybe budget for some of those. It's on a crawl. It's not a terrible flip. It's a. Uh, a lot of aesthetic. So you got, uh, let's count the windows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve, thirteen plus a picture window if you want to go that far. I wouldn't, but just, you know, budget 13 windows. Let's go in the out exterior of this uh, house here. Again, the uh, no popcorn ceilings, no. Uh, no wallpaper to deal with. Driveway looks a little crappy. I think a little weed killer. Maybe uh, add another lane here in a, in a hard surface of, of some sort. Maybe concrete or asphalt. I'd paint the exterior. I'd budget for that. It's aluminum siding. You can uh, throw some storm doors up. Clean this up. That's got to go. That is uh, commercial store wi storm windows. You know, store glass. Uh, yard's nice. Really nice yard. This here... Maybe just budget for a piece of Azac or a piece of one by. Um, get rid of the pelt. I guess they were hillbillies of some sort living here. Uh, patch up what you got to patch up. That's a really nice shed. It's like a 10 by 24. But you could clean this yard up nice. This is a nice shed. Maybe throw a roof on there. I wouldn't budget to get rid of it. You got some metal shed, get rid of. You can do a lot with this. The roof, I think you save. I think you you clean it, you get rid of the satellite, you patchy patch where you have to, and uh, you call it done. So this is a quick video of number 11, Warwick Road, Stratford. Give Brad T a call, 609-352-6910. For those investors, I'm going to show it to you. You already know who I am. But for those who happen to pick it up randomly, feel free to give me a call. Brad T from Remax, 609-352-6910. Thanks.